These students are learning to become machinists at the NTMA training centers. And despite the slow economy and high unemployment, graduates from NTMA are getting jobs, says Michael Kerwin, NTMA's president. He told me about a new list of job openings. A list of job openings that have come into the school here, and there were over 185 on the list. We just handed them out today. Uh, this month alone, we've placed uh, 35 students. That's for January. Uh, in December, we placed 25. The numbers have just gone up, increasing, have increased every month, and we, uh, that's the way it looks right now. And for a small school, those are big percentages. Oh, huge percentages for us. We haven't seen that kind of an increase in ever. The National Tooling and Machine Association training centers help people get into the manufacturing business. And these jobs start at good pay levels. The jobs that we're seeing are $14 and up. And we see it's just expanding like crazy right now. We're seeing the mom and pop shops hiring. And we're also seeing the big companies hiring. Alcoa is uh, has come to us and, and is now asking us to send students to four of their locations. Many of the students at this NTMA training center in Norwalk came from other lines of work that weren't secure, including home building. A lot of construction, hands-on work, up and down, inconsistent. No, no security in that? Not huh? at all, yeah. not at all. How about you? Um, I was a general contractor. James Curley knows that his future is brighter now. Yeah. Well, I researched it before I I attended the school right. and I saw that there was a lot more jobs for CNC machining and machinists than anything else. And then we met Randy Wilson. She's the wife of Isaiah Wilson and she says this is also a better career for her. What were you doing before? Oh, secretary stuff, you know, <laughs> traditional women things. <laughs> and this is going to be a lot different. Yes, I, I'm excited, hopefully, to get shop experience, not behind a desk. A lot of these students have different backgrounds. I was the manager at Burger King. Ammunition specialist for the Army. And for some students, this is a side career so they can continue with school. This is kind of a backup plan for me. So I want to be a, I want to study psychology. So it's just something to fall back on. So you're still going to be going to school? Yeah, afterwards. after this, I'm going to go back to school. You do not need a high school diploma or a GED to enroll. Financial aid is available for those who qualify, and there's job placement assistance. Recent graduates of NTMA work for local companies making pumps for the oil industry and parts for jet aircraft, and they manufacture tools. And they even work for auto design companies creating models of future cars. Some students are just out of high school or over 55 years old. There are computer and programming jobs in the future. Joe Pinto is the owner of Los Angeles Pump and Valve Products. The type of pumps that we develop are for offshore oil platforms, for fire pumps, uh, for dams, for larger projects. Training was excellent. They came in here, obviously they had a wonderful base. So the base of their, they didn't know everything obviously, but they knew everything that we could build upon. Joe Pinto is very optimistic about the future. So, so we see a lot of uh, business coming back from offshore, coming back to the United States. So no, we're very positive about, uh, about the future of LA Pump and Valve and for manufacturing in the United States. The NTMA training centers are in Ontario and Norwalk. Call for information and a tour. 800-962-NTMA or go to trainingcenters.org for information on how you can get to work.